and they shun all the other guns of this world that are contrary to your will, our Heavenly Father. Bring revival and spiritual awakening to our nation, King of Kings. We pray all of these things in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Amen. Let us continue to pray as we pray for the presidency and the leadership of this nation. Our Heavenly Father, Almighty and ever living God, you rule all nations and direct them according to your will. We pray that you will guide and remember our President, His Excellency Dr. William Ruto. In a very special way, we want to thank you for him and the Deputy President regarding Ashagwa. The Lord, today we stand here to celebrate one year since you put them in our office, Heavenly Father. It is you who, lead, who chooses leaders and put them in authority. We pray for them, Heavenly Father. The Lord, you shall guide them. The Lord, you shall uphold them. The Lord, you shall give them courage, Heavenly Father. And the Lord, you shall give them all that they pray and that all they are seeking in the, in the prosperity of this nation, Heavenly Father. We pray for the cabinet, Heavenly Father. The Lord, you shall unite them even to bring the prosperity of this nation. We pray that, Heavenly Father, every decision that shall be made in those meetings, Heavenly Father, shall bring the unity and prosperity of this nation. We pray for the parliament of this nation. We pray for the Senate, Heavenly Father. We pray for the members of the parliament and the senators, Heavenly Father. The Lord, whenever they sit, Lord, you shall guide them in every kind of debate they shall make in our parliament, Heavenly Father. Lord, they shall be led and be guided by you, dear Lord Almighty. We pray for the 47 counties of this nation. We pray for our governors, Jehovah God Almighty, and the county assemblies, Jehovah God. We pray that development shall be a reality that brings prosperity to the counties, Jehovah God. We thank you, Lord, for every readership, every person given authority to lead this nation. We pray that we shall help them to bring the prosperity of this nation. Guide them and lead them, Heavenly Father, even as they rule and lead us in the name of God the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let's pray for the families. Father, in the name of Jesus, you are the creator of the family. You created Adam and Eve at the Garden of Eden and you gave them sons and daughters. And today, we are also the product of that. And we are standing here as Kenya saying thank you for our families. Thank you for giving us families. Thank you for the first family in this nation, O oh Lord, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for the second family in this nation, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for every family that is headed by fathers, in the name of Jesus. Thank you for every family in this nation, headed by women, in the name of Jesus. May you be a father in every family. Whether it is headed by men or women, may you be the father because the Lord Jesus introduced you to us as our father. Thank you, Lord. We stand as Kenya and say families are going to continue in this nation without interruption in the name of Jesus. We lie against every madness of gay sin and the wickedness of lesbianism in the name of Jesus. We declare our sons shall not marry men. Our girls shall not marry women. In the name of Jesus, your word says whatever we shall declare here on earth, it shall be done in heaven. We declare as Kenya in the name of Jesus, no homosexuality. In the name of Jesus, our girls shall be married by men. Our men shall marry women. In the name of Jesus, and right now, every union of men to men, and girls and women to women in this nation, we scatter it now. Scatter in the name of Jesus. Scatter never to arise. In the name of Jesus, we declare our schools are safe. Our children shall not be lured to this madness. 
in the name of Jesus. Those in the primary schools, those in the secondary schools, in our universities, no homosexuality in the name of Jesus. Kenya has been possessed by the Lord Jesus. Possession of the Lord Jesus. Devil, you have no portion, you have nothing. The Lord has taken the whole of Kenya to himself. And we say thank you, Lord, for making Kenya your property. We honor you and we bless you. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let's continue praying matters health. Father, in the name of the Lord Jesus, we lift your name, we bless you, we adore you because you are our God. We thank you that you created man after your own image. You blessed him. You commanded him to be fruitful, to multiply, to subdue and to have dominion. We want to rise against every form of illness, every form of disease among us, our people. We take power and authority in the name of Jesus. And we declare that our people shall lead a good life. They will be full of life. They will enjoy good health. We cover them with the precious blood of Jesus. We lies against the spirit of cancer, the spirit of diabetes, the power of hypertension. We declare all these diseases. They 